Don't you want to be miserable? I tried being successful and happy. But it's bloody hard. And then I realized the secret that being miserable is actually quite easy. And it's acceptable too, because most people are miserable. You'll make a lot of friends. You'll have a lot of compassion. But most of all, it's easy. Only five simple steps. Make sure you always remember, it's just work. There's no real reason to stress out over it. You have a life outside work. You can do all the things that you love after work and yeah, after sleep. But again, no reason to stress. You don't have to align your career with your life. There's plenty of time afterwards and those hours at work, they will just fly by. Don't think of putting extra effort in either. You're paid a salary and that is for the bare minimum amount of work that you can get away with. If there are challenges at work, pass them on to your colleagues. If there are promotions, only go for them if the money is good. Otherwise, save your energy for the things outside work. It is also worthwhile to remember, life is hard for you, much harder than for anyone else. If they succeed, it's no real surprise, they are privileged, but you are misunderstood and undervalued. Okay, we can only do so much mundane work. So let's daydream a little bit about another career. That's a good way to pass the time. And we all know that if you were just on that other path or in this other job, you would act totally different than you are acting today. It's not you, it's the job. Remember that it's a job and you work for money. So make sure that you always, always spend that money. Reward yourself for the hard work, for all the dread that you have to go through. Make sure that your bills equal the income that you have, because otherwise somebody might come along and say, you can actually leave and follow your dream. And that would be hard. I am not proud of this, but each of those thoughts at one time or another was in my head. And why wouldn't it? Because as humans, we love to take the easy route. And being miserable is far easier than being successful. It's also a lot less risky because success we always have to justify to other people. Misery doesn't need an explanation. Crazy thought. If you followed this channel for any period of time, you know that we talk about unconventional ideas, how to get ahead in our careers, and even align them so that they become a true part of our life rather than an inconvenience. Maybe this is for you. As for me, I'm going back to being miserable. See you next time.